Welcome back to my booth, Irfan here. Today I bring for you yet another projector. But it is not just any other projector, it's a pretty special one. Now you know that I don't go for the ordinary ones uh, and this one is special in more than one way. This is the BenQ GV30. This is a portable projector with a 720p HD resolution, a built-in battery that can last you two and a half hours on a single charge, a 2.1 channel audio system with two speakers and a subwoofer, which is a first in portable projectors by the way, a very unique and interesting design, and all of that encased in beyond good quality craftsmanship. This retails for about 598 US dollars or uh, 2200 UE dirhams. I'll leave a link for it in the description box below. Now, there's a lot more to show and uh, talk about, and believe me, I will, but first, let's go ahead and do some unboxing. It comes in a pretty meaty box. Inside we have an Android stick and a very nice looking hard case which holds the projector, a magnetic sitting base for the projector, a remote control and a DC power adapter. Now since this is a portable projector, the case is very convenient for carrying it and all of its accessories anywhere you go. If we talk about the build quality of the projector and the remote control, I can tell you it is as good as they come. This is what truly high quality looks like right from the material to the steadiness to the finishing around the edges to the neatness in the buttons everything screams high quality and this is not new for BenQ they are known to produce such high quality products all the time the projector has a very unusual design it looks like a whistle with the mouthpiece cut off actually a better analogy would be a circle with one pointy edge but you get the picture if you saw the projector for the first time you might actually mistake it for a bluetooth speaker because of the mesh all around it and that is because it has two speakers one on each side and then a subwoofer on the top to deliver tremendous bass as well as clear high quality audio which i'll demo in a moment other than the projection lens and a bunch of sensors there are only four buttons on the projector for power, volume and Bluetooth connectivity. There's a quarter inch screw hole on the bottom if you wish to use it with a tripod. On the port side, we have the DC power port, a headphone jack, a USB-C port to play media off of flash drives and an HDMI port to connect to laptops, gaming consoles, Blu-ray players and etc. And then finally on top is a very good looking leather strap for carrying it around. One of the side panels have a small gap to pry it open and inside you'll find a slot and this is where the Android TV stick goes which comes with it. So when you power it on, it boots as Android TV and it barely takes a couple of seconds. The biggest advantage of this is that you can directly stream media off of the internet on all your favorite platforms just like you would do on your phone. You've got YouTube, Twitch, Amazon Prime and you can always download more from Play Store. You can't however download Netflix because Netflix does not support projectors but you can bypass that by either launching Netflix on your phone and then casting it wirelessly to the projector. For iPhone, it is as simple as pulling down the control center, tapping on screen mirroring and then tapping on Android TV. And of course, this is not just for Netflix. You can basically cast anything from your phone onto the projector. The projector also shows instructions on how to cast from other devices like Android phones and PC. The other way to get Netflix is to download an app called Aptoy TV from within which you can access Netflix on the projector itself. Talking about the video quality, the GV30 has a native resolution of 720p HD, which is good. It is not great as you have 1080p and 4K projectors out there, but for a portable projector, it's pretty decent. And trust me, what it might lack in video, it makes up for with its incredible audio. Just to give you something to compare, first I'll play a clip on my iPhone at full volume, which also happens to have two speakers by the way, and then switch to the projector in between. Irfan here and today we'll be looking at a gadget that is fresh off from a Kickstarter campaign. It has exceeded its target funding. Welcome back to my booth, Irfan here and today we'll be looking at a gadget that is fresh off from a Kickstarter campaign. It has exceeded its target funding. The GV30 can project between 30 and 120 inches but it is recommended to keep it between 80 to 100 for best results. 
The unique design of the projector allows for 135 degrees projection angle, so you can basically project it on the floor, on the wall as usual, or even on the ceiling by simply rolling it in its cradle. The auto vertical keystone correction and autofocus makes sure you have a perfectly rectangular and sharp image at all times. Now, just like many modern projectors, the GV30 also comes with an LED so you don't have to worry about any lamps and this LED is capable of producing 300 lumens of brightness which is plenty bright even in a room with some ambient light. The battery inside takes 2.5 hours to charge and will give you about 2.5 hours of playtime which is very decent. The Android TV stick lets you stream uh, from the internet but you can still go old school and hook up other devices like your playstations or PCs via an HDMI cable. Since there is a minimal cable lag, it is suitable for playing games. There's nothing like jumping back 14 years and playing Counter Strike 1.6 Assault Map on a 100 inch display. Something I find not very significant but still interesting is actually on the remote control. It has a dedicated Google Assistant button and a microphone, so you can simply give voice commands into the remote control. Hey Google, can you open up YouTube? Opening YouTube. Did I also mention that the remote control is super easy and intuitive to use? You don't have to play Bomberman to get to a setting or an option on the screen, no matter whichever app you're in. It's very easy. I think we've pretty much covered everything and now it's time to wrap it up. The GV30 is one of very few projectors which can deliver in almost all departments. It has superior build quality, stylish and practical design, portable, decent video quality, Android TV stick with built-in Chromecast, exceptional sound and bass by Trevolo with a 2.1 channel audio system. You can actually just use it as a Bluetooth speaker, it's that good. With the exception of USB 2 and memory card, it has a decent connectivity panel and a pretty good battery life. It might not compare to a home cinema, but the portability totally makes up for it. You can use it indoors, in the backyard, take it camping, to the office, anywhere basically. I'll leave a link for it in the description box below in case you want to check it out. That's it for now guys. If you enjoyed watching this video, hit the like button below and share the video with your friends and family. While you're there, don't forget to subscribe to my booth for more gadget reviews, DIYs and life hacks. You can also follow me on Instagram and other social media. All the links are in the description box below. Click on the thumbnails to watch my other videos or check out my YouTube channel for more. And as always, thanks for watching.